Meanwhile, there's a call for massive response from eligible groups in Cross River State that has commenced the vaccination of frontline workers across the 18 local government areas. The state. state government made the appeal while flagging off the local government area based vaccination at a federal neuropsychiatric hospital in Calabar. And reacting to the availability of the vaccines and its proximity to frontline workers, the Director General of Cross River State Primary Healthcare Development, Dr. Janet, notes that so far 95 sites are already designated comprising primary, secondary and tertiary health facilities. Currently in Cross River State for this first phase of um, the vaccine rollout, we have 95 sites in Cross River State currently where these vaccines are going to be made available or where health workers will be vaccinated. So uh, we've divided these 95 sites into various LGAs and uh, we are sure of um, covering all the targeted population in this um, uh, site. So we have 95 sites currently in Cross River State for this first phase because we're looking at um, health workers as some strategic leaders and these sites are enough to um, cover the targeted population. So well, we have officers who have been trained um, to um, assist um, health workers or people who will be wanting to take the vaccine to register. We know uh, we had already shared um, the um, link for registration. However, we know some people are having challenges um, registering. So uh, for those who can't register by themselves, at the various sites where they will be receiving this vaccine, we have people who have been trained to actually assist them in um, registration because you must register before you can um, get, receive the vaccine.